Well, what is up, everybody? That's right, it's Atlas, and this is the best thing that could ever happen. Spawning in on a boat that doesn't exist. Oh, gotta love this game. Well, what's up, everybody? That's right, it's your boy Bloodstalker, and I'm moving things around, so there's going to be a lot of weird, squeaky noises, and I apologize for that. I've got my audio fixed, I think. I'm not going to make any guarantees. It's better than what it sounded like before. Let me turn my main audio down on my... Is that going down? It should be, yes. So where am I at? Well, yeah. This is... What can I say? Oh, there's Rhino. What's up, Rhino? He's been asleep. He's worked hard. You know, everybody's been asking me, what are your thoughts on Atlas? Well, first off, let's just say this. Welcome back, everybody. This is 20... Well, this is still 2018. It's going to be 2019 soon. I'm coming back officially from vacation today. Today's Sunday. That means new content, new videos, everything else. Some of them are still going to be pre-recorded with the guys, with um, Autumn, Cage, and Mike. So those videos will be coming out. Now, we're behind, but we just recorded Stable for the first time this weekend. So, yeah. Damn, did you just fart? My God, Anon. What the hell is wrong with you, man? I mean, we've been playing a lot of this, and I have not been able to record it because of audio problems, which I'm fine. I'm glad I'm not able to record it because it was just frustrating and stop. It's just frustrating. It's weird. There's two oh, bodies. Oh, no, no, I'm back. Where did these bodies Whoa. come from? Whoa. What the shit? <laughs> <laughs> you can't, you can't pick just quick. I'm getting, I'm getting skinned. Somebody hit him with the hatchet. I don't have a hatchet. Somebody get the hatchet on him. Shit. I got it. I got it. I got it. Sorry, Anon. Don't look, Anon. Don't watch. Just don't watch, Anon. We got to do this. So this this is Atlas. Let's just talk about Atlas. You see everything around you. We're not at a free port. Um, free ports are basically places you can go to like just chill out. You know, have a good time. But you can only stay there till you're level eight, which is cool. That way, it keeps people from building around the free ports, and it gives people new people to play in the game opportunities to get ready. Now that's cool. The problems I have with this game is the fact that, like I said, we're supposed to have a sloop. We built the sloop yesterday. Release ship. Here we go. Tell me what I need to do. Oh, wow. We're sinking. Full sail. <laughs> that was, that was anticlimactic. I got on last night about 10 and 11 o'clock last night and re repaired it. Rook got on at 1 o'clock in the morning and repaired it. Savage Rhino got on at this, or Anon, a non user. We'll call him Savage or Non, whatever. Um, the man with many names got on this morning and sent us a message saying that the, the sloop was gone. We don't know what happened to it. I don't know if something took it out or what. We didn't get a chance to lay a land claim block, which sucked too. I've recorded all this. The audio just sucks really bad, but I am going to clip a lot of that in because uh, we're done with this game. I don't think we're going to play it until they do more updates to fix a lot of the land claim issues because there's a lot. All right. I see it. I see a claim flag as well. Two claim flags. Now you can test the counter claim theory. Um, this game is fun and has potential to be a really good game. There's a sloop up there, it looks like. I mean, it's hard to get to make these boots. Yeah, boats. Yeah, there's a sloop right there. Let's go check it out. I don't think the people are here. We actually started out here, and we're, like, swimming across that big island to get to get wood. That's the only way we could get it, and we grinded our butts out. Yeah, there's he's, he's right there. See, they made a sloop, man. Sloops are awesome. The problem is they don't last long, apparently. Nothing lasts forever in this game. So unless you get on every single waking minute of your life and play Atlas all day, every day, you're not going to get shit done. That's the honest truth. Me and Non and Rook have put a combined total of probably over 120 hours into this game in the last week and a half since it came out. Whether it be frustrating through all the patches. When we first started playing, it was on 3.0. I don't even know what it's on right now. Hold on. Let's see if I can get a number here. Um, version 7.9. 7.9. Do you understand that? 7.9. 
So you understand this? This stuff will, is basically will, de will dem demolish and decay. So you can't really just set bases up anywhere because people can take over your shit or destroy it if they see fit. Even though it is PVE, by the way. We run a PVE server. So, I mean, what do I think about Atlas as a whole? It's a great game. We built a sloop. We built a dinghy. We had a lot of fun while we played it. The problem is, that's all you do is repeat the same fun you already had, which gets old. Grinding out to make a ship that's going to fall apart and disappear. It looks amazing. It's beautiful. It performs so well on my rig now. I'm getting like 75 to 80 FPS constantly. Sometimes I get 100. The animals and creatures in the game are amazing. Look at this wild ostrich. It's beautiful. Look at the rhino. I mean, it looks beautiful too. Yeah, look at that. Third time's the charm. Fourth time lucky. Yeah, we got fourth time lucky, fifth time lucky. We made so many wraps. The wraps don't last that long either. Like, this one's probably going to break. Um, you can only carry so much weight. You can level your wraps up. It's really cool. I mean, I do enjoy it. We got it anchored right here because this is the only place we can stay. I think they fixed the raft breaking. At least this one's not going to break. But still, we're on a crappy spot. And wind screws you in this game. Right now, the wind is blowing away from is blowing away from the well. It's blowing yeah, away from the island right there, which we need to go over there to get resources, or go to that one. So we're kind of in a screwed spot, but it is man, what it is, and it's Atlas. Will I continue to play it? Probably not for a while. I think we're going to leave it alone for a while. I really put my time into making better content on better games that I enjoy playing and don't grind out. Because to make one video in this game, it'd probably take us about a good five hours just to get content out to make it interesting each time. That's legit. We'd have to repeat a lot of things over and over again before we were able to sit down and record. And I'm not going to dump and dedicate my life into doing that crap. I'm sorry. I don't play just one game. I just can't do it. I play a lot of Seven Days to Die, I know. But now that I've got this baller computer and can install every game I possibly own in my collection, 10 terabyte hard drive, which I will be doing a video on that that's coming out. The vlog is. I'll be recording that this afternoon. i got to take a shower and get my hair did. What do you think? You like that? You think I ought to get my hair did for it? Yep, lumber on through there, buddy. Not trying to record anything there. Nope, not at all. Don't mind me. You gonna take a shit now? That'd be perfect. Really? I'm just gonna park that fat ass right there, buddy. Yep, move it along. Beep, beep, and beep. My God. So anyway, it does have a lot of cool features to it. Combat system's pretty cool. You just hit the left alt button and you can target whatever you want to take out. And you stay locked in, which is nice in this game. Especially since there's a lot of things you can fight. And I'll show you what it's like. Come here. Oh, you're mate boosted. I don't want to fight a mate boosted one. There's too many rhinos around. Freaking. Oh, hey, buddy. He's only level two. They got a long ways to go. Because, I mean, look. Check me out. I'm already level 11. I think Rhino's, what, 16 now? Rhino can make the stuff. Rhino's our, 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 our man. He's our man. He's our man. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Let's go back over here and look at Rhino. But, <clears throat> do I recommend playing this game? If you like getting struck in the games and just having a blast and doing things over and over again, it might be a game for you. Right now, I'm going to wait. I think me, Rook, and Anon, all three can agree that, you know, maybe some things just need to be left alone for a while. Are we always this far out? I feel like we're further. So, he's level 14, my bad. I mean, we got to this point. It was hard getting there. The thing that kills me, though, is like that sandstone is stone. So you have like a different name for it for the resources, but overall you have a secondary name for it, like stone. So I could just type in stone and give me anything with stone. I could type in fiber, which that's fiber. Multiple things can be considered fiber. Multiple things can be considered stone, flint, etc. So like there's some poppies. Those are consumable, by the way. You notice down here on the bottom right, you have like, I don't know what they are, but one is like a vegetable. One is not. So you have to eat all the time. And it, honestly, there's no sense in doing it. If you got a bed on your raft, just let yourself die from starvation. Respawn at your raft. Don't waste your food resources while you travel. And you got to travel in teams. You can't do this by yourself. Because if you die and your boat's still moving, you got to stop it in the middle of the water. All sorts of craziness happens. Is that a vulture? Son of a bitch. No, it's just a seagull, isn't it? Vultures are on this place. They're nasty. There's always some. Please tell me that's not an alligator. Sea bass. I hear you. What the hell? Is this dude stalking me? I mean, there's really nothing they can take, is there? Yeah, we don't have anything in the smithy. They probably took it all. You can't lock your smithy either. Sucks. You really have no way of protecting yourself. There he goes. And there you have it. Oh, someone's taking out trees. So, that's the other thing. Is I mean, you're playing on a server with everybody. How it works, that's the interesting fact. So here's your here's our map of the quadrant we're in. 
really? Okay, Anon, you're interrupting the video. We're just got the middle here. I love you, Anon, but damn it, you're snoring loud. All right, you can go in your inventory and you can look at the main atlas right here. You can zoom out. Now these, there's quadrants made up within this whole map. And this is the whole map. See, this is where we've been at. This is a Freeport area. Bring all nine power stones to Center Mall. See, these are like quests and things you can do. Power stone. These are places you can get the power stones. They started slowly adding this stuff in. I mean, honestly, this game has got an amazing foundation. I mean, it's got an amazing thing you can do. We've discovered discovered a couple of things. I mean, the foundation of it's great. My problem with it, we even got Jester on here playing it too. He he automatically refunded it though. <laughs> Seriously, he just said no. He wasn't too pleased with it. I'm not a big fan of the skill skill tree. It's kind of hard to get into that. You got search skills and skill, craftable ones. Then you got inventory. And the crafting in here, if you ever turn that off, you get screwed. But you can turn it off and on. You turn your backpack off and on too. So, I don't know. How it goes down and everything, it's got a great foundation, great start. I don't think this game needs to be encompassed to the fact that you're supporting the 40, up to 40,000 players though. Because that's where the, the, the crap of why your rafts break all the time. Because if you're not going to play the game, they don't want to clutter up their servers. Well, okay, that's fine. On a dedicated server where you can adjust gather rates, you can adjust everything, I think it would be a phenomenal game to play. If you know somebody that's playing that, can I not just harvest that? There we go. Wild chilies. Alright, so let's see. We can eat the wild chilies. We eat the poppy. So that's making the green bar go up. Fours should be making the green bar and not go up too. I guess it does. Alright. So you gotta constantly eat stuff. How do you get water in the game? Well, you gotta find a patch of Greenland, which there's none over here whatsoever it's another reason why you want to just die but you have to get down on the ground and dig for it but I'll show you so we do it right here see so you can't dig for water here so you got greener ground so yeah I mean it's just weird this whole place this whole game it's a different concept but it just they need to fix the mechanics to it all it's my personal opinion anyway what do I think about Atlas? I think that maybe eventually if they if they work on fixing balances and stuff the game could be amazingly fun you can a way to keep your base on with more than about a day, less than a day, I'm fine with it. If you can at least have to, you have to get on at least every couple of days, I'm fine with that. Four days, it's like rust. You know, you got somebody in a group that can do it for you, you can take turns, set up a schedule, hey, that'll work out. But you can't even keep shit for over a day. It's ridiculous. I'm telling you, man. I'm telling you. Anyway, I know this has been kind of a short video. I just wanted to check out, get audio checked, show you off Atlas, because a lot of you guys have been asking about it. And I have to say, pass on it for right now, guys. I mean, if you do pick it up, only understand you're picking it up for a good deal. That's why. Because eventually the game will go up, and it will be good. I have faith that it will be good. I think they just need to figure out how they want to do things. See, I'm freezing my butt off right now. So awesome. I'm just going to die. I just want to die. Anyway. Anyway, I've been your lovely host, Bloodstalker. This has been Atlas. And if you, if, if you really want to check it out, watch a lot of people's content on it. Make sure they're, if they're, what they're doing is on official servers or private servers because sometimes looks can be deceiving. Anyway, you know the drill. Till next time, peace out. Going under. Yay. Can you, can you like turn to the left? I'm trying. You want me to drive and you sail? Go like out back out to sea. <laughs> That's what I'm trying to do. Yeah. But you know, it slows us down hitting these waves like that. So I'm trying to like flow through them. Oh my god. Oh, Jesus Christ. No. We're not, we're near it. I mean, we're away from those guys. Okay. We can't go off. I can tell an on that, yeah, they do fight. They're dirty. <laughs> you reckon? <laughs> I think we're not in Toto. We're not in Kansas no more, Toto. There's a shitload yeah. of them out here. I didn't yeah. know you were a religious man. <laughs> 25,000 health and there's four of them. Yeah, I pretty much think we're not going to win that one. Oh, we got this. <laughs> we with got me. This. <laughs> I'm going. No, I'm just kidding.
Bye. That's a lot of them, dude. That was just crazy. Yeah, so we're gonna we're gonna end up heading back towards bloody Freeport at the end of this raid. I think that's when you go near the like you collect runes or something and then have to go oh, to. Oh, ship straight ahead. Oh, ship straight okay, ahead. right. Hard. Uh... Do you need uh? Do you need assistance? Yeah. <laughs> Someone taking us to the right a bit. Well, it looks like it's turning this. Yeah, we should be good. We got quite close to one earlier. It's a kind of reference. That's some funky colours. Oh uh, no, it's turning into us. Go faster. I might leave the game at this point and uh, <laughs> it all goes wrong. <laughs> Front sail needs turning uh, so we can got wind on it. Ooh, now if he turns right, we are going to be in trouble. Yeah, this is definitely a three-man job. Because you've got to be doing a lot of running around. <clears throat> yeah. There we go, there we go, there we go. I should get this going. Oh, we're cooking it now. We're cooking and booking. Hey, hey. What do I got to say to you? You know what I'm going to say to you. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, 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 it's when the other three spawn in. Then it gets interesting. Ooh, yeah. That's cool. Still be trying to buy it. Oh yeah, it looks like he's yeah. definitely biting. It looks like he likes me dancing. No, no, he's not. Oh, he's doing a circle. What the hell are you doing? <coughs> you gotta get into a circle. Yeah, the brain. It looks like he's trying to. Yeah, we don't want to get much closer than this. Yeah, he's keeping up with us. Maybe he's gonna kill us. He's trying to run along us so he can shoot us. If he turns right, then uh, we might be stuck. We'll turn to the right slightly. That's when they load the cannons. Thanks, Thanks for <laughs> There he goes. He's breaking off. Nice. Breaking pursuit. So I think that's when you've got fish swimming underneath you. Oh, so if you've got the fishing rod and the chair or something, then you can uh, catch fish. He's backing up now. <laughs> that's just a guess. We're going to have to dive into that. I think he's coming after us again. What the hell? <laughs> yeah, I'll keep doing um, little circuits. Made a discovery when I spawned in. They won't oh let us. God. Won't let you what? They won't let us drop the anchor. Well, I'm about to die, so I'm going to quickly go and swim to the shore. I can place a claim flag here. Oh, Where? Right really? here, right here. <laughs> but, but it's just, but it claims it's part of the ocean. But yeah. Claim the beach. I can see their claim though. I'm going for it. All right. I'll I will uh, reach dry land before I die. <laughs> I'll stay over here just in case we need to do. You can definitely bring the, the ship in as far as where I am here. Okay. And then there's a bit of a shelf underneath it. But yeah, you should be good to get quite close. And there's vultures. God, they got a lot of this area claim. This whole side they've got a claim. Probably just need to run around Yeah. A discovery. Oh, man, Found run. Yeah, they're oh, they're yeah. about to come and chew on me. Oh, okay. I've got a good view of you guys coming in. So I'm getting screen messages. Yeah. Uh, yeah, the vultures are found me. And that's me. 
We need to go on the other side of the Well, that's me out. The rest is over to you guys. <laughs> Have fun. Keep, uh, keep the boat in good order now. Keep it all ship shape. We will do the best we can. We'll do the best we can. Alright, take care, fellas.